don't know if anybody out there can relate, but like I have a hard time with life sometimes. Right. Sometimes it's great, but a lot of times for me it's really hard. And um and no matter how I'm feeling, like I always find myself like struggling with certain patterns of behavior. I find myself like stuck in like a, in like the same thing that keeps repeating over and over again. And I'm just like, how do I end up? How am I in this? And it's that moment where you're in it, and then you kind of separate yourself from that situation, and you look at it, and you see it for what it is, and you you're able to then do something about it. Like you you've now broken out of that that circle, that cycle. I know that for me, when I'm inside myself, when I'm in my own head, it gets this place right here, this 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 skull between my ears. That is a bad neighborhood, and I am I should not be in there alone. <laughs> I need. I can't be in there by myself. What are you talking about? It's just. You just. You just. It's insane. Crazy it's crazy in here. This is a bad place for me to be by myself. And so, when I'm in that, like, I get, I, my whole life gets thrown off. Like, if I'm in there, like, I don't say nice things to myself. Like, there's another Chester in there that's like, wants to take me down. And so, um, and I find that it could be whether it's substances or whether it's behavior or whether it's like depressive stuff or whatever it is like if i'm not like actively like doing getting out of myself and and being with other people like being a dad being a husband being a bandmate like being a friend helping someone out like if i'm not if i'm out of myself i'm great if i'm inside all the time i'm i'm horrible i'm a mess and so for me it's like that was kind of where i don't like my mind right now stacking up problems that are so unnecessary you know that's where that kind of that was where that came from for me and um and that's but it's the moment where it's like realizing like i drive myself nuts like actually thinking that like all these are real problems like all the stuff that's going on in here is actually just i'm doing this to myself and um regardless of whatever that thing is and so this is that like conscious awareness of that thing and like when you when you can step back and look at something like you're actually elevating yourself consciously like you're 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 enlightened at that point right to a certain degree and so this is that moment of enlightenment where you go you know i could do something about this and by doing it i can move forward and get unstuck from this and then i could actually be able to for me it's like i can live with life on life's terms like i can can experience the whole spectrum of humanity and not want to get out of it whether it's happiness sadness or whatever like I just want to, like, I, when I'm in it, I just want to get out of however I'm feeling, no matter what it is. So when you wrote this song, you were clearly in that bad neighborhood in your brain. Or this time last year, I was a mess. Like a total wreck. You know, and like, I think for a lot of people, they think like, if you're successful, like all of a sudden, like you get like a green, like you get like some card in the mail that says like, you're going to be totally satisfied and happy for the rest of your life. It, it doesn't happen like that. Like, life for me happens the way it always it's my the only difference is i'm in lincoln park like what goes on inside my head it's always been this, it's always been this way for me so when i'm not working on that like my life gets messy and that's kind of the how the the inspiration for all these songs came from conversations about life and what was going on as friends as husbands as fathers as you know whatever business partners like we were all talking about what was going on in all aspects of our lives at certain times throughout the process of this record. And we realized like, man, we've all gone through like some really crazy stuff and we don't need to find the source of inspiration. Like what's this record about? Like this is our life. You know, the, we always have written about our lives and like that should just be enough. We don't need to find some new thing. Like life is always throwing these like curveballs at you, whether they're good or bad, like it, it just happens. And eventually what I found is, especially with the bad stuff, because that's the stuff that I kind of lean, that's the stuff that, I, that sticks to me a little bit more, coming out at the other side and being like, man, I'm a better person because of that. Or I can, I'm more compassionate because of that. Or, you know, I can understand, I feel like I can understand people or humanity a little bit differently because I've been through some pretty crazy stuff. And that's a positive. So finding...